Now to the breaking story overnight, the terrifying moments on board a Greyhound bus when a man pulled out a gun. Yeah, and that led to a high-speed chase across state lines. This morning, we're hearing from some of the 50 people who were on board. ABC Stephanie Ramos is in Washington on the story. Stephanie, good morning. Dan and Paula, good morning. Passengers on that bus said they were absolutely terrified and they didn't know what to do when this guy started saying he was going to kill them. And they were even more confused when the driver of the bus didn't stop even after rolling over spike strips. A male Hispanic has a gun in his hand on the Greyhound bus. Overnight, a horrifying ride for dozens of passengers on a Greyhound bus. Male Hispanic, short, black hat, making threats that he's going to kill everybody on the bus is on a gray home bus, he has a 32 in his hand. Police receiving reports of an armed man threatening to kill other passengers as the bus traveled from Milwaukee to Chicago around 10 Friday night. Police from both states joining the high speed pursuit, shutting down the highway in both directions as they closed in on the bus. The bus finally coming to a stop about 45 miles into the trip in Wadsworth, Illinois. All 50 passengers escorted off the bus safely. Who's going to kill us? Who's going to put a bullet in our head? The suspect was taken into custody. Dozens of police cars blocking traffic as police investigate. This morning, state police tell ABC News, thankfully, no one was hurt. Everybody was scared in the back, yeah. I mean, because you don't know what to do in those kind of situations. So you just do the best that you can. So scary. That man was arrested, and the passengers are just thankful that it all ended the way it did. Paula Dan. Stephanie, thank you.